Hello and welcome to Soft Expert. As promised in the previous video, today in this video I'll be showing you how you can create a solar panel website or an agency or a shop just like this one. And this is basically a template kit that you can import to Elementor and you can design the website using Elementor just by drag and drop without any coding. And before creating the website, let me give you a quick tour of the website that we will be creating in this video. And this is the website, so here you can see on the top we have a logo. Then all the required pages along with services, projects, contact and all these pages with a call to action. This is the main section, so basically a slider you can see. And then scroll down, you will see this section. This is another one for about or something. And this is another section where you can display your projects. And this is another section. You can also notice the hover effects also the coming animations like these this is a process tip we have a video section and then a context section and then a footer so this is the website that we will be creating in this video and obviously you can customize this based on your needs you can also visit all these pages i'll provide a link in the description if you want to check out Let's see how we can get this template and how we can set this up on our domain. So to get this template you can just follow the link in the description which will take you to this page. Here you can see the title. This is the one time price. So you can buy this for just this price. This will be for lifetime. And then you can learn more about this template also. Now let's see how we can install this. I already have this. Let me show you. So once you buy the template you will get a file like this. You can see the title. Now we just need to upload this to our world page. So let's see how we can do it. Now you can use any theme that is compatible with Elementor like Blocks theme, Astra theme but the one I would recommend is Hello Elementor theme which is Elementor theme and very fast and reliable so let's add the theme and this is the theme so just install and activate this and once you activate the theme you can delete this one and this theme also requires Elementor so you can click on this to install Elementor plugin this will be our page builder. Let's activate this. And now you can go ahead and connect this with your Elementor account where you can use some advanced features like AI, image generator and so on. But let's close this for now. And now we can install that template. But before that we will need another plugin called Element Kits. So for that let's go to plugins, add new. By the way to learn more about this you can just go here. And here you can see how to install it. So install and activate Inveto Element plugin. So we will need this plugin first. So I'll search for that. And this is the plugin that we need. So let's install and activate this. And then in the next step, download the kit that we already have. And go to Elements, Install Kits, and click Upload Template. So let's go there. Once you activate the plugin, you will see this elements. So just go to Template Kits here. And this plugin also have some templates that you can use and you can install. And if you want to upload your own, you can just go to install kits. And here you can upload that zip file. So just click on this plus and select the file that you have downloaded. Then click open. And this will upload the kit. And now you can see this is the global style, the home page, about page, and all the required pages have been imported. Now some of the templates will need additional plugins like you can see here. There are 5 requirements that need installing for this template kit to work properly. So you will have to install these plugins to run this template properly. Let's click on install requirements. And these are the required plugins. So let's click on install. And that's it. Now we can close this. And now we have all the requirements. So if you go to that link, check for the orange banner at the top and click install requirements. We already have done this. Then click import on global style, click import on a template at a time. Then go to pages, create a new page. Now this is a long process but I will show you this shortly. So let's go back here. The first thing we need is this global style. Okay, So we need to import this. And that's it. Now we can go ahead and create pages and we can import these templates one by one. So you can import the pages that you need like the home page, about, contact and so on. This will be dependent on you. Let's go to pages. I'll add a new one. We'll close this and I'll give it a title of home. That's it. Now let's edit with Elementor. 
and you can also generate images using AI in Elementor. I have a video about this. Let's close this and let's close this also. And let's close the navigator. And now to hide the page title, the header, the footer, you can just go to its settings. And here you can click on this hide title and then choose this to Elementor full width. Now to import a template, you can just click on this green icon. This is from Invero Elements and this will show you your template so let's click on this and here we can insert any of these templates to this page so as we are creating the home page we will choose this one and we'll click insert template and that's it we got the whole template on our page this is now loading the slider but let's scroll down you can see that section that i showed you another about section this one and we don't have images because those are copyrighted images we can just ignore them this is the play icon for the video and so on so this is our home page now and we can just publish this or by the way if you want to customize this you can just click on anything for example the title and you can change the title here same goes for this text you can change this here and you can click on this and here you can change the title the description and also all these texts are changeable here just by drag and drop if you want to make changes or add an image you can click on this image you can choose a file and you can upload your image and you can also choose from your media library now these are empty images because as i said these are copyrighted images so you can upload your images and you can insert them. So this is our homepage and we have published this. You can preview this by going to this preview. And here you can see that page. And this is similar to the demo that I showed you. So let's go back and uh, let's see how we can import the header and footer. So for that we will go back to our dashboard. And now you can add your header and footer by two methods. One is to use Elementor Pro and uh, you can go to templates, you can go to theme builder and you can import your header and footer. But if you don't have Elementor Pro, you can do it for free using this plugin, Elements Kit. This is a free plugin using which you can create header and footer. But before that, we will have to import the templates. So let's go to Elements and we'll go to Install Kits. We'll open this. Let's scroll down and this is the footer and this is the header so we need to import both of these now we have imported header and footer let's go back to element kits header and footer we will need to configure this but you can just click on this basic by the way these are the elements available in this plugin so if you don't want to use any of these you can disable that let's go next next and that's it and again let's go to header and footer we don't have any template okay so to add a new template you can just click on it new and you can give it a title like i'll call this header and the type will be header because we're creating header and condition we need this on the entire website we will activate this and we'll edit its content and the procedure is same you can just click on this green icon and open this now go to header this one and insert this and that's it we have our get started button and this is the menu but we don't have any menu for now we will add it later on this is the logo you can change this also let me use the temporary logo for example this one so now we have our logo i'll just update this and to create a menu you can go to your dashboard and then you can go to appearance menus and here you can create your menu so first of all let's give it a title like main menu we'll create this now we can add items to it we only have home page we will add this and we can also add custom links for example about So let's say this is our menu, okay, I'll just save this and then we'll go back to Elementor to add a menu here. 
I need to refresh this. So let's refresh this. You can see we are regard that menu. So you can choose your menu here. Okay, now let's check our website. I'll open this in a new tab. Okay, we will have to select our home page as our main page. So for that, let's go to settings, reading, and here we will choose a static page and display that will be home page. Save changes and let's refresh and that's it now we have that logo the menu it started i mean the header and the whole website let's quickly add the footer also because this is very empty so let's go back to our dashboard from this and remember we are under elements kit header and footer so we will add a new one i'll call this footer and here we will choose footer again for the entire website we'll active this and edit content and open this this time we will choose footer and this is our footer if you want to make changes you can just click here or anywhere you can change this to 2023 you can change this to your website title and that's it and let's say this is fine so i'll just update this and now if i check the website you can see at the end we have that footer again you can add your logo but that's fine we have the social icons the menus about and so on so this is our home page and you can do the same for all the pages like you can add your about page you can import about template you can customize that and so on so this is how you can buy a elementor template and then you can import that to your wordpress website and this is how you can create a solar energy website by using this template again the link in the description so you can just buy this from here and if you want to learn more about elementor and wordfish you can just follow my channel i have lots of videos about wordfish and elementor including setting up other themes still if you have any questions you can ask in the comment section thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next